I wanted to start off by just giving you an update on where we are on mall redevelopment. So over the last year, we've continued the conversation with the owners and with our consultants. And so if you recall, probably about a year or so ago, the majority of the mall was sold to a new owner. And when they took it on, they said, okay, give us a minute. Let's let us get the day to day down. Let us get the mall running and continue to run and let us get acclimated and we'll come back to y'all. And they did. And so where we are now is that they are going to be, we're going to be meeting with them next month in person with their architects to go over potential recommendation and changes to the initial plan. So the initial plan that we worked on with our consultant, it was a culmination of talking with the owners and of course talking with the stakeholders in the city on what we'd like to see there. We're anticipating that the uses will, will stay fairly the same. It'll be a mix of employment, uh, mixed use development, so uh, retail as well as open space and keeping both the day and night activities going to keep those businesses that are going to be there, that are there thriving. And so we have that meeting coming up and then once we get to that point and we get a little bit further down the line, we anticipate starting to draft a plan development and that PD will then govern what types of uses can go there, what's the minimum and maximum types of uses that could go there and we will work through it on that through that process we're also hoping that in the next year the reciprocal easement agreement that is executed amongst the owners will also be either amended or terminated because that will also then open it up for all of this redevelopment and the additional uses to happen and the last thing that I wanted to note is that the Vista Mall public street infrastructure project is on the 2020 for bond election, those funds, if approved, are for infrastructure only. I just, Mayor, I just want to say, um, great job, everybody. We've been looking at this uh, mall redevelopment for how long now? <clears throat> Two, three years? Um, Unlike the information on at, social at, media. At least since 20. 13, maybe yeah, well, 2014. Yeah, but I mean, just us collectively. Um, and you would, the, public engagement is so important when it comes to this, because you would think that on social media, for those that think that social media is the encyclopedia and know all, that we haven't even looked at this project yet. And um, getting this out to the public is is paramount, but it's also the responsibility of our citizens. You can look at it on our dashboard. It's all right there. And just to be cautious and not use uh, social media as the actual information, the real information for Louisville, because it's not by any means. Thank you. This is amazing. And um, when it comes to fruition, it's going to be oh, so great. Of course, I remember camping there, and I remember when <laughs> stables were there, so. Okay, well, I don't remember that, Ronnie. Um, but I, I, w I wanted to reiterate that, um, you know, th this effort has gone on for a long time, and it's going to continue to go on for a long time. This is not a sprint. It is a marathon. And, um, you know, a couple of years ago, maybe we had, uh, we talked about this at either retreat or uh, I think it was, it was retreat. retreat. Okay, mm -hmm. um, you know, there's there are so many pieces and parts to this that that I didn't even understand um, and still don't fully understand, uh, and and likely we're going to get into some more as as we continue to move this forward. But um, I'm really encouraged to hear that the ownership is on board because without that it doesn't happen um, so just focusing on the fact that this is going to take some time this is not a private entity or a public entity this is both of them working together and to overcome uh, a huge hurdle um, so I, I just wanted to uh, 
remind the public that this is moving and there's probably going to be times where it seems like nothing's happening uh, but this is going to happen and it's it's working its way through and staff has been really diligent working on this and i just wanted to say thank you i'm really really excited to see this happen I'm going to jump in with support here as well, real quick. And this this is the good stuff. I, I've I've heard somebody say recently, "Why do other cities get all the good stuff?" This is the good stuff. This is going to be exciting. This is additive to our overall economy. It's how we present as a city. It's fantastic. And this the Lake Parks projects. Lila has been out there for a while. That's another great. But this is the good stuff. I'm excited about this. Thank you. Not, not to not to belabor the point and sound like our uh, suburban neighbors to the south and give a speech, but uh, you know. Government is a tugboat, not a speedboat. It doesn't move as fast as you want, but it does move. Uh, and with good planning, when, when we have time, and this took time to get the owners down to a level, because I think there were seven owners at one point. I've uh, been on council long enough now, to now to have seen the full, I guess, scale of this. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I still would like a full service hotel that has at least one more room than didn't. Uh, but. The work has been there, and, I, and I, I tell people all the time, you know, the, my first council meeting that I ever attended was to come to complain about the fact that there was there were no um, specialty restaurants here. My wife and I had to go to Dallas, or we had to go in, in, into a Highland Village or something. In that very meeting, they were talking about the three restaurants that were there. So what I learned from that was, you don't really know everything if you don't ask. And things take time because even at that time it was it was still uh, trees over there where the old church was and not what well, well, the a lot was and you you see what what we've done so there's there's always work in progress just because you don't see it doesn't mean it's not happening and just ask us you know and if we don't have the answer we'll send you clear clear knows everything. 